Uh, hello and welcome to Two Wheel Lifestyle where I might be at the Long Beach Motorcycle Show. Me and oh, uh, a few thousand of my best friends. I, I'm gonna do some video here. Oh. Alright, so, so what, what is this based on? An Aprilia Scarabeo 500. Alright, with nice modern rubber and brakes. Yep. I love it. Non-functioning, non-heat-seeking missiles as okay. light housings. And that's a real film canister? That is, from the movie Nightmares from 1984. So real prop. Real, yep. Built right in the bike, and then these are like... What are the uh, foot... What, what are those made from? That is something military, I have no idea. So, the, uh, unknown... The, the canisters, the, the headlight canisters have actually been out in space. In space? In space. And this is based on a Yamaha. Yeah. It's built Yamaha on a Yamaha. Vino 125. All right. And this is derelict.us. My zoom works terrible on this. Nice, uh, nice decorations, Thank by the way. Uh, very appropriate. My, that's my mother and I, and my grandfather who shot those deer. <laughs> All in the family. All in the family. So this is custom work. You come in with ideas, and you work on whatever somebody wants take a, to take a modern, fully functional, fantastic bike and make it the more fantastic. Reliability that you want. Oh, and then this. You make it look awesome. And then this, this one is this one's awesome. I particularly am fond of the foot pedals, the pedals, if that's what you want to call them, the running boards, which are irons. A saddle from a tractor or something. This is the anti-Ducati booth, I've decided, derelicts.us. Modern bits all over the place, sneaking and hiding. Don't forget the skull. <laughs> oh, amazing. Here we are at the Ducati booth. There's a lot to see here, including this model that a couple people seem to have more than a passing interest in. Refreshed, refreshed multi strata. Evil, evil looking face now, I think. And of course, all new scramblers. Array, available in an array of colors. Including this natty yellow. We're getting fitted to the Versus 1000 now. That's a I love the update and styling, personally, of the uh, new Versus, the 650 and the 1000 versus the uh, stacked lighting arrangement they've had forever. Much nicer looking bike, in my not so humble opinion. Right outside the front door, you're shooting down today. Ruining your video. Oh, everybody does, don't worry. Here's the BMW booth. We've got the updated RR. Looking good in red and white, I must say. And we've got the new RS, the 1200 water cooled. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. The 1200 water cooled sport tour that bears the RS name again. Sorry. And we got my personal choice for best of show the BMW S1000XR, which I'm really surprised to see here since it was introduced just last week in Milan. Uh, that would make it a little uh, consumer show like this, but they have it here and it looks beautiful in person. Basically a jacked up S1000R with the screen and uh, updated electronics. So be very excited to see, no pricing announced, no availability date announced, but you can touch it. Oh, very nice. Now 
there are a couple Yammies at the show that have my interest. The R3 is amongst them. It's the 300, it's actually a 320, I think, CC sport bike. Given proper aggressive styling here in blue and red. Yeah, people are surprised. It's a 300. It doesn't look like a 300. These are going to do well. This one's for you, Space Pod. <laughs> now, see right next to it is the uh, RFJ09, which is, all, I will call this a poor man's Multistrada. Um, about half the price, and certainly not delivering half the bike. Shown here in a couple trims, the big tall screen here, and here's a silver one, gray one, the smaller screen, probably some different options on it. All coming with the famed triple. And looking good. Well, more stuff in the vein of something different. Motoped. Now that's a naked bike. And so, until next time, I will see you all out there on two wheels. Well, there you go. That's this bike. Not everybody can handle the evil that this bike will bring to you. And so that's it. That's my summary. It's evil. Uh, if you can handle evil, you'll be fine. If not, well, learn. <laughs>